Madison Trump, and Evan Bates. They're one of America's top ice dance teams, competing in Sochi and Pyeongchang, and now their third games together in Beijing. These two are one of the best in the world. Partners on the ice for more than a decade. Partners off the ice. Well, that happened too. It was only when we started skating together that we started spending a lot more time together and we started, started this bond and this friendship that eventually grew into a romance. They've known each other since they were kids. As teenagers, there was a hint of what was to come. Y'all were high schoolers, 16 years old, and you went on a date. Is that right? Evan took me out to dinner for my 16th birthday to Bahama Breeze. <laughs> she wore this black dress, pink stilettos. I love that you guys still remember like these details. You know where you went. You remember the red truck that he picked you up in. Yeah, his mom's red pickup truck. <laughs> the young love would only last a couple more dates. But years later, things would heat up again right there on the ice. When was the moment, Evan, that you knew it was more than just a work partnership? <laughs> you know, it took like five years before I really came forward and expressed my feelings and wanted to be more than skating partners. And when that eventually did happen, kind of some of our friends around us were like, well, duh. And I was like, oh, huh, that's so interesting. I <laughs> feel the same way about you. Huh. <laughs> Where did that come from? But it had to have always been there. Maddie and Evan live together in Montreal. They train up to six hours a day at a top facility there. The couple's precious moments off the ice are filled with their poodles, Henry and Stella. Maddie is an artist who designs the couple's skating costumes and Evan plays the guitar. Together they share their stories about life and competition on their podcast called Unlaced. Welcome to Unlaced with Chalk and Bates partners on the air, on the ice, and in life. Could either of you have ever imagined sitting at that booth in Bahama Breeze that this is where your life would take you? No Honestly, way. No, no way. way. It's crazy. That's why we tell each other, can you, can you believe we're skating together? Can you believe we're <laughs> dating? It's really fun to look back and just think about how much we've experienced together and how our lives led us to each other and just keep evolving in unexpected ways. Oh, I loved the way they looked at each other. It was really beautiful. And Maddie and Evan told me that they get mistaken for a married couple all the time, including yeah. when they went to a competition in the bulletin. It was like, and the married it's couple. Oh, yeah. And so then that just led me to ask yeah, um, when they're going to get married. And, oh. and they said no plans yet that they will. And I actually tried for them um, to do a <laughs> proposal on the plaza. Nice. Is that when they left the Zoom? <laughs> That's when they said goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, y'all, there's Cute. love out there. Yeah. love them both. Does that happen wow. often? Ice dancers fall in love? Or is that taboo? Or uh, they, no, they all I have so much chemistry. I, I always well, think they're all dating. Yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> that's the thing. I think, and there was actually a hilarious meme. Mm -hmm. I think you put it on yeah. Instagram yeah. that each ice dancer needs to say if they're siblings, <laughs> they're married, <laughs> right. yeah, or they're just part of I think of the partners. commentators should just like say it at the beginning. Yeah. 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 Like they train here, they do this <laughs> trick, and they're dating. But yeah. their chemistry, I mean, the way they Undeniable. looked at each other. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. You even felt it right here. Watching oh, yeah. I felt it in my office. Happy Valentine's. Oh, cute. Sweet. That is cute. Jenna, thanks for that. And by the way, you can find even more out about Maddie and Evan later this afternoon on our streaming channel that we have called Today All Day. Mm, okay, cool.